Shalom Chavrim, I'm Stephen Benun. You're watching Israeli News Live here in Munich, Germany. And behind me, there is a huge number of uh, ambulances and emergency medical services. All types of uh, transportation has been shut down. We have still terrorists on the loose. It has been uh, not, cannot be linked, according to the authorities as of yet, to terrorism. It is suspected to be a terrorist attack here on Munich, but unfortunately, these gunmen are still on the loose. There are nine confirmed deaths so far. There's been an attack on the subway system, of course, at Olympia Mall, uh, just right in behind me here. Uh, there have been at least six deaths from Olympia Mall uh, alone, also from Karl Plotz uh, as well. There has been shooting reported there, and the authorities are trying to get a grip on this, trying to find out who's behind it. And even though it has not been linked to terrorism as of yet, the ISIS and ISIL uh, people that are on Facebook and all these other different social medias that they're under there, they are celebrating this attack here in Munich. It is a tragedy. As we know, this has been a city of tragedy before the 72 Olympics, uh, where Israelis were killed by Palestinian terrorists uh, who claim the responsibility of taking the lives of the Israeli uh, Olympic athletes uh, back at that time now. And here we are right here in Munich, Germany, once again, and terrorism is gripping this city. It is a tragedy for the people here, and we, our thoughts, our prayers, no doubt yours as well, are going to be going out with the people here of Munich. Uh, earlier, we seen about five different police cars, two, five in one group, two in another group later, leaving the, uh, this area here on the interstate, coming in, heading in the direction of Nuremberg. Uh, Nuremberg is only about 25 miles from this location, but it still appears to be that the suspects are at large here in the city of Munich, Germany. I'm Stephen Benoon with Israeli News Live. Shalom. Guys, we continue to cover here uh, here at uh, the train station here, Hauptbahnhof. Uh, I can't quite pronounce the name of that. I'm sure you can see it on your screen, though, if you speak German. And the train stations are closed here. The You can see several, quite a few police cars here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten police cars here in the parking lot. All transit is shut down. This is a subway system here. And, uh, of course, there's no lights on the police cars going off in this particular area here. But um, people are outside the train station uh, waiting for transit system to open up again. You can see those down there on your screen there. A uh, large group of people there waiting to try to get inside. Um, we, let's see if we can zoom in through the windows of the train station there where... Uh, police authorities are inside, and uh, I've seen, of course, you have baggage. Uh, I don't know if this is actually considered a subway or an actually train rail itself, but uh, I've seen numbers of police walking in, uh, in and out the building here as uh, we are here watching what's going on here uh, live in Munich, Germany. You, we are covering the terrorist attack here on the city. Um, of Munich, where the suspects are still at large.